YouTube and welcome back for another episode of Chrono Trigger! Just have to give you guys a little heads up. I don't remember a whole lot of what we did last stream because the last time I played Chrono Trigger was over a week ago. Unfortunately, I had COVID hit my household and I had to kind of quarantine in my living room. Thankfully, I didn't catch it, but I still had to take precautions. So I couldn't play Chrono Trigger for over a week, which means my memory may be a little off track of what we were doing previously. But if you enjoy this playthrough, please don't forget to leave this video a like. Subscribe to the channel for more Chrono Trigger episodes. And if you'd like to join us live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Lunity, I'd love to have you in this community. So, like I said, it's been a moment since we have been here. Forward to the past. We have the whole squad with us. Oh yeah, that's right, we had the Masamune. We fought Magus with the Masamune. And we're back to prehistory prehistoric times. And just for the record, everyone's doing great post-COVID stuff now. I'm back to my regular setup, which has been nice to be back. I'm, I'm very thankful. And uh, I'm excited to get back to playing some Chrono Trigger. I haven't played games in over a week, so... Whew! Yeah, I can't remember where we were supposed to go, so let, let's figure that out real quick. Chief, look! La Ruba Village, Northwood! Chief, okay? Oh, La Ruba Village, Nor- okay. Northwood, fire, burn, big burn. Okay, they're all saying the same thing. So, La Ruba Village, okay. Is this La Ruba? Ruins, okay. Reptites take Kino. Reptites kill all, try, kill all. Try stop reptites, what do now? <laughs> reptites follow Ayla, Ayla, bad luck. People fight. Reptites kill all. Oh no. Here she is. Ayla, this your fault. Look at village. Reptites follow you. Now village ruined. Ayla, sorry. Reptites strong live long before us. So we hide. But Ayla say fight together. Ayla still say fight now. Ayla alive, Ayla fight, win, live, lose, die, that rule, no can change rule, old man breathe, but dead inside, dang, Ayla strong, so make big talk, we not, not strong, no strong, fight, get more strong, Ayla help, but now need dactyl, give dactyl, Dactyl? Go, Tyranno Lair! Tyranno Lair, Reptite Castle! Danger! Even Ayla danger! Ayla want die? <laughs> no, want live! So go! Ayla be okay! Give Dactyl! <laughs> yes, give Dactyl! Elder tell Keeper, so go Dactyl nest! Ayla be careful! Elder, big help! We just came here to witness this exchange, I guess. You take care, Ayla. I think I remember us going to this dactyl, which was all the way up here. Yeah, dactyl nest, I remember. <laughs> oh boy. Chrono! You would go alone? I do not know what has driven you to this quest, but a friend of Chrono's is a friend of mine. I will not stand by while you go to your grave. No, Tyranno Lair danger. You no come, maybe I'll die. You wish to die alone then? I fear I cannot allow that, not after having accepted your aid and hospitality. There has been death enough on my watch. I'll abide no more. Let us be on our way, Chrono. Isla have good friend. Let us proceed to the Tyranno Lair. <laughs> oh, this guy, he's got friends! Okay, the question is, do we still want Robo? I feel like I can't just not have the frog with us. Is it just me? Okay, let's do frog. He's gonna be our only source of heals though, which I'm a little... hesitant about. <gasps> Did I ever refresh on my consumables? I don't know if I did. Uh-oh. 
I don't know if I can buy heels anymore. <laughs> Rot row. <gasps> Cutscene! Oh no! Wait, why are you guys not able to see it? Oh my goodness. Okay. Saved. These cutscenes are so good. What's up with that star? What does it mean? Oh, look at us! Dude, am I actually able to just fly around? What? Well, here's the thing. I need consumables because I don't remember... <gasps> Wait, how am I supposed to know where to go? This is like Bowser's lair, you know? Like, that's like the, the end game. But the thing is, I don't know if they sell consumables in this... <laughs> like, do they? Oh, okay. Yes. Can never have too many. I'm scared. This is a big moment. Tyranno lair. <sighs> Oh my god. Ooh. Okay. I don't know how that didn't trigger like a a fight, but okay. Wait, why are there dudes here? Hello? Wait, what what am I fighting? Hello? Reptite? What the? Oh my god. Yeah, the frog's a great character. Go. Oh, mid potion! Slurp kiss dual tech. Bubble burst dual tech. Okay, nice. We're getting some dual techs. Be free, my friends! Nice! Turn key. We're about to have a feast, and you're about to be the roast beast. <laughs> it's the apes! Uh, what's the, um, slurp kiss? Heal all allies and restore status. Lightly heal ally. Oh. Little kissy. Mwah. Frog's level increased! The frog! Hey, oh! It's, what's his name? Ayla! Kino, move back! Ayla, save Kino! Girl, there's a button to the right. You can press the button. There's a button. Oh, she's climbing? What the? Uh. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Kino, sorry. All Kino's fault. It okay. Kino, take all Laruba person. Run! What Ayla do? Strong live, weak die. Ayla, go be strong! Kino, go too! Kino, no come! Ayla, die! Kino, no new Ioka chief! Ayla. Ayla, Ayla, I don't fucking know. <laughs> she just burst through there. <laughs> Jesus. Ayla, strong! No lose! Kino, no. Kino, show you something. Ki follow Kino! Okay. Even though Chrono's strong, man. <laughs> you strong. Kino weak. Kino jealous. See? Chrono's strong. Oh. Damn, he jealous of us, y'all. Okay. Because maybe if I go up here... Hello? <laughs> um... Oh, okay, oh god. Uh, hi. Looking for Azala? She's just through here. Okay. What the? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> this guy just let me through? 
Why? Okay, never mind. Hold it! I was like, you're just gonna let me waltz through here? When I said she's through here, I meant you gotta get through me first! What do you think I was flexing my muscles and looking and intimidating for? <laughs> I don't know! You didn't do anything! Uh. Oh my god. Ooh! Ooh boy! Okay! Whoa, 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 whoa! Wait, item? Ah! Uh... Yo, chill, 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 chill. Slurp kiss. Hurry, slurp kiss. Huge. Okay, lightning again. Gotta bring that defense down. And then let's do the round dillo kick. We'll have we can have him just regular attack. Can they slurp kiss? <laughs> She only has five. I'm gonna give her another ether. Oh, he's dead! Let's go. That was for science. I want to make the record clear. I was doing that for science. Okay, I'm gonna save again because I can and then I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna Okay Sick And then I'm gonna just press down on the d-pad <laughs> Got it Ha! At last, a final confrontation. It was but a matter of time. Will it be we reptites who inherit the earth? Or are you soft skinned apes? Isla, oh, strong live, weak die. Isla, just fight. I'm waiting for the place that I can fall through the floor. Hear that lovely voice? You'll soon be hearing more of it than you'd ever wish. Okay, why did they have to jump off the chair like that? This chair is pretty sick though. Whoa! What the heck? What? Damnable red star! Yeah, what is the red star? Fall, why don't you? Stain the earth red! Even should it prove our fate to die, we will not relinquish this world to the likes of you. This black tyranno will have the honor of wiping you filthy apes from existence forever! <laughs> Dude. Why do they gotta stand so close to the edge like that? It's making me nervous. Maybe I should get rid of the Azala. Why did I say V again? It's just Azala. <laughs> or Azalea, I don't remember the name. Iggy Azalea? <laughs> Attack. Whoa, look at that boulder! Let's get rid of Iggy first. Iggy Iggs. Um, I wanna try the lightning rod. Yeah. That was so dope. Please do a lot of damage. 743, okay. Cat attack, 104, not very good. Sap? Okay, I don't know. Okay, I was just about to say. Uh, oh. Okay, what if fighting or beating Azela first is like a bad idea? Okay, I'm scared. I have no idea how much health this thing has. We're doing big damage to it though, no? Three? Okay, wait, no, stop! Make it stop, dude, I don't freaking know, I'm scared. Oh god, I have no MP. 
Fuck my life. Okay, please kill it? How much health does this thing have? Hurry! Go! Oh god. What if we live? Oh god. Oh god. <gasps> okay, we're, we're alive! Oh my god. Uh, slurp kiss immediately. Do we have a triple attack between the three of them? No, we don't. Lowers defense. Oh! When he's doing the countdown, he takes more damage. Got it. How much health? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I was gonna say. Let's go. Yes, a level up for two of our friends. Ha ha ha. Got him. Where are you going? The music. No, it can't be. Could the heavens truly have sided with the apes? Listen, primates. Primates, and let it be known for all time. We reptites fought proudly to the bitter end. Ayla, no. Huh? What is happening? First, a great fiery stone will crash. Oh, ha, this is not Ayla. First, a great fiery stone will crash to the earth. Its flames will soon spread to scorch every corner of the land. Then the chill will begin to creep across the blackened plains, ushering in a long, cruel age of ice and snow. Ha ha ha! A fitting end to our age indeed. Ha 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 ha! Lavos. Oh, shit. The dinosaurs. <gasps> Dude, I just got chills. Why did I get chills with that thing? <laughs> it looks like a face with like a septum. Dude, I don't remember any of this at all. No. Why does that give me chills? Ayla people word. La mean fire. Vos mean big. Oh, didn't the people in her village say big fire? Voice? Ayla! Kino! Oh my god. Dude, things are getting intense. Uh, hi, tiny zucchini, by the way. Welcome. Hurry! Lavos fall soon! All right, Dactyl! Dude, I don't know if where we're supposed to go. Kino, hurry! I don't know where we're supposed to... Ayla, what do you do? Come! Azala, come! No! This is the will of the Earth! Hmm. Ayla, hurry! Azala. Ayla, not forget. Take. Take? What take? Take care of this world. I meant septum piercing. The, like a ring, like a bull ring. It looked like a face with a bull ring. Lavos was not spawned by Magus. It fell from the heavens, and so long ago. <laughs> Your wise witch voice is impressive. Thank you. Lavos huge! Chrono, fight that? Is that them? Chrono, we go place Lavos fall! What the... Left to its own devices, the creature will burrow deep into the earth, 
Best defeat it now. Wait. What? Guys, I don't remember this at all. Whoa, can I just go in here? A gate. <gasps> Lavos fast! Deep under earth now! Might Lavos be the source of these? That one in Magus's keep was uh, immense. <laughs> what wrong, Chrono? Won't fight Lavos, he go here, no? Is that really what we're supposed to do right now? Shit, I guess. Okay. I should have saved. Fudge. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Where are we now? To where have we come? Chrono, where this place? The future? Question mark? What the? 12,000 BC? Antiquity? Ter what is that? We're trying to find Lavos right now. Skyway? Wait, why is this kind of futuristic in the Ice Age? Hmm. What the hell is this? Where are we going? What the f- <gasps> I don't remember this at all. <laughs> what the fuck? This is the magic kingdom of Zeal, where dreams can be made reality. But nothing in this world comes free. There is always a price to be paid. Hey, You are most unusual visitors. Am I waking, or is this but a continuation of my dream? Regardless of that, I welcome you to Zeal. Her Majesty Queen Zeal rules this magic kingdom. She is without peer in beauty or grace. The Queen has sealed away the great elemental weapon and armors forged within the power of the sun in the Shrine to the North. You can see its entrance on the northern continent, but no one is allowed inside it now. a part in the forest that was also in yeah I looks familiar what was that an espion dude there's an espion in this game Doreen <gasps> he seems a sullen lad what's wrong that animal for eat taste good Espeon boy. The black winds howl. One among you will shortly perish. Young one, of what do you speak? Hmm? I do not know what this portends, but I did not like the sound of that at all. Strange boy, but not bad boy. Suspicious. Okay, that boy was weird. Um, small cave, Kajar, Blackbird. Okay, let's visit around a little bit. This is the magic city of Kajar. We perform research in the magical arts to help further Her Majesty's plans to deliver our kingdom even greater glory. Has Lavos happened? Like... In ancient times, people crafted wondrous weapons and armor by combining shards of a rainbow-colored shell with the sunstone's power. Oh, I remember... Yeah, the, um... There was an old man that asked that traveler guy to go after, like, a rainbow shell. And I don't know if we know where he went or something. 
but now only the Guru of Life knows the art of crafting such things. And even if others did, the Queen has ordered us to abandon use of the sun's power. Ah, such be beauteous contentment there is in a newly blossomed bud. Would that, would that I could be a flower? That's the Sun Temple which you see on the Southern Sky Isle. The Sun Stone, once our primary source of power, was enshrined there. However, the temple was sealed up along with the Northern Shrine once we turned to our new energy source. The Queen claimed we'd no need for the energy of the tired old Sun. Okay. All right, I'm getting a lot of information here. Her Majesty Queen Zeal has two children. Lady Shala and young Lord Janus. Lady Shala is an incredible child with extraordinary magical powers. With such a gift, her life must be all ease and luxury. I heard Lady Shala's powers far surpass those of her mother. Then there's her brother, your young Lord Janus. He's of royal blood as well, of course, but doesn't seem to have the faintest trace of magical ability. The blueberry! <laughs> yes! Oh, the palace! Okay. This is the Queen's Palace, in the center of the Magic Kingdom of Zeal. Which is to say, this is the center of the universe. It's quite the statement. The source of our energy rests deep below the sea. Once its exact location was determined, we began constructing the Ocean Palace there. Ocean Palace? The portal to the Ocean Palace is in Her Majesty's audience chamber. Mind you, it hasn't been completed yet. Okay... That wandering prophet is amazing. Every prophecy to escape his lips has come to pass. It's as though he already knows the events to come. Unnerving, is it not? What if it's that traveler dude? That man appeared only recently, but he earned the queen's trust quickly with his startlingly accurate predictions. His origins are a mystery. He is not one of us enlightened ones, but nor is he an earthbound one. Uh, from where could such a man have come? Okay, it's either Magus or the Traveler guy that I don't remember the name of. <gasps> Shala! Oh, Janice, you've returned. Is something wrong? The Black Winds. You feel the foreboding too. Don't worry, it will be alright. Here, keep this close. What is it? It's an amulet containing my prayers. If something should happen, it will keep you safe. I wish that I could remain with you always, but Mother has other plans. That's not our mother. She looks like her, but she's not the same inside. Hmm. Even still, forgive me, Janice. Pardons, Your Highness. Oh. The Queen requests your immediate presence at the Ocean Palace. Very well. Well then, Janice, I must be on my way. Oh, who might you be? Forgive me, my lady, but we must hurry. If we're late, I fear I'll be... Uh, well, you know the queen. Of course, my apologies. Go away. Janice and his espion. So the queen is possessed, probably, just like the chancellor was. Let's go to the, um, th maybe this room first. Whoa, this room looks crazy. Melchior, the guru of life, opposed the queen's plans and disappeared shortly or thereafter. It pains me to consider some conspiracy may be at work, but it is terribly suspicious. When the Mammon Machine was finished, the Queen became a different person almost overnight. A much colder one. Just between us, I heard that any who oppose Her Majesty, and not just the Earthbound ones, vanish and are never heard from again. If the Mammon Machine is moved to the Ocean Palace, we can extract even more energy from Lavos. The dream of eternal life will be made possible. Operating the Mammon Machine requires magic powerful enough to regulate the energy of the... Bleh. Regulate the energy the machine extracts. Accepting the guru, the, I can't talk. Accepting the gurus, Lady Shala is the only one with such power. Hey, the red blinking thing. 
the three gurus constructed the mammon machine from a reddish stone that had been kept in the royal treasury for generations. The guru of life, Melchior. Wait, Melchior? Dude, I feel so stupid. I was like, why is Melchior's fucking name so familiar? Melchior is the fucking blade master guy, the weapon dude. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, I forgot. <laughs> Okay, to be fair, listen, I haven't played Chrono Trigger in almost two weeks. Cut me some slack. At least it finally kicked in. He is the Guru of Life. Okay, huge reveal in my own personal brain. <laughs> okay, the research on the nature of Lavos, but now, well, I'm sure you know the rest. I'm not so sure I know the rest, to be honest with you. Aren't Gurus intern as scouts? <laughs> Oh my god, okay, let's visit the queen. She's probably possessed or something. Oh. <gasps> the door! Aha! We need that amulet. We need that amulet! And then we can open this up in the future! Her majesty said she had business at the Ocean Palace. None may pass until her return. Your pendant. It looks identical to Lady Shala's. Oh? I heard that when Lady Shala communes with the Mammon Machine, her pendant glows with a strange light. Oh? I feel like there are some, um, what's the word? When you, when you travel through time and there are paradoxes? Like, is it the same amulet? I don't know. If it's the same amulet, how does she have the amulet, but I also have the amulet? I don't know. Oh god. This feels like a bad, I don't know. I'm scared. That's it? I don't know. Now I'm gonna have to remember every single place in the future that had these doors. I let go! No be scared, Chrono! What trial awaits us next? Who are you? Okay, wait. She looks familiar. Maybe I did get here <laughs> in my first playthrough 20 some years ago. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Who are you? How did you get in here? Your Majesty, these are the bringers of disaster of whom I spoke. Indeed! They and the gurus alike! How dare you outlanders attempt to oppose me! Fools, one and all! Dalton, seize them! Yes, Your Majesty, with pleasure. Golem! Golem! What? Where? Oh, shit. Oh gosh, okay. <gasps> um! <gasps> Wait! Stop! Oh my god! Wait, okay. I have one revive. This is bad. This is so bad. This is very not good. Hurry, hurry, hurry! No, please! Fuck! I'm so effed. What the hell? Okay, this is bad. This is really freaking bad. This is really bad. Did I save? Like, forever ago? Oh my god, are you serious? What if this is a scripted... I feel like... <laughs> I feel like, what if I'm supposed to die here? I feel like it's scripted, y'all. <laughs> Fear not. I won't kill you. Not immediately, that is. I'll allow you to sample every type of pain and fear imaginable first. By the time we're through, you'll be begging us to end your suffering. Ah, uh, what a delicious diversion. Okay, it seems that way. <laughs> uh. Hey, Marvin. 
It's not scripted! I mean, we're still alive. We're still continuing the story, so that tells me. Yeah. Hm. Idiots. What would you do, Shala? Let us help them. I don't think I'll be of any use, and you'll be in trouble if you let them escape. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. And they just might be able to rescue Melchior. Saved. <laughs> Are you alright? Quickly, you must flee the palace. And if you can, please, free the Guru of Life. He was sent to the Mountains of Woe for opposing my mother's plan. Please, you must help him! I'm afraid I cannot allow that. Oh, who said that? I'm afraid I cannot allow that. I don't know who said it. Somebody walking in. Oh, boy. Your meddling tires me. It seems I'll need to put an end to you here. No, you mustn't! <laughs> don't! Meow! <laughs> Very well. I'll spare their lives, but in return you will cooperate with me, Shala. Now, show me how it is you came here. Is this the mat? Like, uh, I don't know. Hmm. So you came through here. You can see he's got like purpley hair, but I don't remember what the, like the Magus looks like. They have similar hair, though. What if it's Shala in the future? <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting crazy here. Now, Shala, once I throw them in, you will seal the portal shut. No! You can't make me! You will obey me. Their lives are at stake. I... Uh, very well. God, my eyeballs. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Damn, what if I was supposed to go on the blackbird? I don't know if I missed stuff. What if I missed things? Please forgive me. Okay, where are we now? Are we back to prehistoric times or what? He spared our lives, true enough, but something is amiss. They take Lavos' power. Lavos get weak. The emblem upon the door that Pendant opened. Had you not seen it in any other ages before? We sure have. Mm-hmm. I recall. I remember. Uh-huh. A curious crest is engraved here, and a mysterious force seals it shut. It seems our only hope, does it not, Chrono? I've read that weird as hell. Okay, sorry. Hey. There isn't a place to go to the 1200 BC? <gasps> Guys, I feel so dumb that I did remember Melchior until oh my god man I am actually so impressed by this game though like it's been so long but the story is just as good and like everything is just as good like I'm so excited about this right now the unfortunate thing about this game that is really difficult for me is having to choose our party members because how am I just gonna really leave party members like I don't I can't all right, folks, we're going to be wrapping up the episode here for today. The story in this game is so good. I don't remember so much of it, which has kind of been a blessing. Like, since I've played this over 20 years ago, it's been kind of nice to re-experience it and to see how good it is still. Like, it's holding up really, really well all these years later. So we're going to continue next time. We're going to have to see what to do next. We, I think we have to go back to the future. Haha. <laughs> 
to uh, use our pendant on those doors and stuff. So I guess we'll be doing that next time. But if you enjoyed this playthrough, please don't forget to leave this video a like, subscribe to the channel for more Chrono Trigger episodes, and if you'd like to join us live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Lunity, I'd love to have you in this community. So thank you so very much for watching, and I'll see you on the next episode. Bye!